Hey everybody, it's Bubbly from Zero for One, and I'm back with my much anticipated collection tour for 2020. My collection is primarily OF models, a majority of them being Peter Stone over Briar, but I do collect both. I do also have two customs, and I will show them to you as well in this collection tour video. I'm going to start and just go from shelf to shelf. I'll show you kind of how I have it organized. I have reorganized my collection since my prior uh, collection tour videos, so you will notice that in this video as well. And let's get started. So starting at this top shelf here, we have kind of a collection of my patterned uh, stock breeds and some draft horses as well. So going from left to right, first over here we have my Glossy Cody, and her um, show name is What a Feeling. I'll tell you what their OF Briar names are and their show names as well. So next to her we have my OF Briar Bay uh, Tobiano Matt Bollywood Surprise from Briarfest 2017, and his uh, show name is Cat Tracks. And then next to him we have Out of the Blue. She was the 2019 Collectors Club membership model, and I have decided to call her Double Exposure. Moving on next to her, we have one of the more recent uh, classic releases on a new mold. This is American Dream, and I've decided to call him Tartan. And next in we have another pretty recent Briar release. This is Ambrose. He was a Briar uh, Collectors Club web special of 350 pieces, and his show name is Divine by Design. And then we have next to him Carter. He is the Collectors Club 2020 membership model, and his show name is Be More Chill. Next to him we have probably my rarest model in my collection. This is Carlisle. He is the Briarfest 2012 Saturday Raffle Model, limited of 26 pieces made, and his show name is Kings of Twilight. And he's really uh, a lovely model. He is mapping and he's really nice. Next to him we have Vahana. He was a Briarfest, I think, 2017 special run? Pretty sure. Um, and he is really nice. His show name is uh, Purple People Eater because he's very purpley. And then next to him we have Alba. She was the, uh, she was a tractor supply kind of special, um, special run model, limited run model, and I don't know what year she came out, I cannot remember, maybe 2018? Pretty recent, and her show name is Fear of Flying. And then we have uh, the first stone to show you on this shelf. This is Dipped in Gold, this is his show name. His original finish name was... Uh, renewed Mind, I think, I'm pretty sure. And he is a one-of-a-kind done by Cheryl Leisure, and I cannot remember the year that he was made. It might have been 2017 or around that time. And then we have this little guy. This is the foal from the Fiona and Rory set that Briar made. It was a special run, uh, web special release. I think he's available to most people now, though, not just Collector's Club members. And I cannot remember what year he came out, either. He's pretty cute, and his show name is Blazing Comet. So moving on, we'll go over here. I do have to stand on a stool to get to these uh, taller shelves. So starting over here, from left to right, we have this guy. He is another stone. He is a uh, factory custom, one-of-a-kind foundation quarter horse on the stone uh, foundation quarter horse mold. And his original finish name was Shaden, and I have decided to call him Love Story. And he was made in October of 2019. Then we have this girl. This is her show name is Hidden Assets, and she is the Briarfest 2019 special run at Diana. And she is in the uh, glossy, I think they were all glossy, but she is the braided mane and tail version. Pretty nice. Then we have my LCR Benefit uh, Red Dunn Lady Phase model, and her show name is Morning Glory. Next to her we have my other kind of OF quarter horse model. This is Raindrops on Roses, otherwise known as the original finish Briar Baby Flow on the Wyatt mold. Then we have kind of my little unrealistics in this tiny section. We have Spearmint. She was the 2019 Christmas Day Collectors Club special offer. The Candy Cane Zebras in green. And then next to her we have my uh, 2018 Christmas Day Collectors Club kind of special surprise. And he is the gold Santa's Surprise Unicorn. And he was a limited run of 350 pieces in each color, and she was a limited run of 500 pieces in each color. And his show name is Swinging on a Star. 
Then we have this little girl. This was one of the Briar, uh, Briar like Walmart unicorn surprise chase pieces of recent. Kind of the rainbow unicorn on the magnolia mold. She doesn't have a show name. She's just hanging out there. And then we have this little guy. This is one of the Chiffon, I think his name is. He is one of the um, Briarfest 2019 single day models that I am going to give him to someone. I just haven't done that yet. Then we have Oliver. He was the Briarfest 2019 um, Celebration model. And he's on the Cleveland Bay mold. Really nice guy. And then hanging out next to him over here, we have Justify and American Pharaoh, OF Briar, Race Horse Triple Crown winners. And then we just have a small little collection of kind of some porcelain animals going on. They're pretty cute. So going up here, we have my uh, stablemate models. I'll just do them because they're kind of on a top shelf over here. Um, I'm just going to breeze through them real quick, not go through all of their names. This guy was part of the store specials of the Bearfest 2019 store special um, stablemate kind of set. We have Saparo, otherwise known as The Mist. He was a collector or stablemate club 2018 model. And then we have this guy, again, another one of the set of the store specials, Barfest 2019 store special stablemate set. We have two Peterstone chips. The little gray is a design horse, and the silver dapple is a 2007 uh, Peterstone, like, regular run chip. And we have this girl, her name is Cityscape. She was just a 2000, I think, 6, 2008 uh, regular run stablemate. Then we have Darley, otherwise known as On the Wing. He was a uh, 2018 stablemate club model. Then we have Genuine Risk. He was, again, um, part of the 2019 store special stablemate pack. Then I have my four little running uh, Mustangs. We have Eagle Spirit, and he was, I think, a single stablemate of some point, some kind. I cannot exactly remember when he was made. And then we have this guy. Uh, this is Fan the Flame. Again, another 2006, 2008, just single, single package, single assortment stalemate. Then we have this guy. This is Kitty Hawk. He was, again, a 2018 stalemate uh, club model. And then we have the Black Appaloosa. He was just part of a four-pack Walmart series of stalemates. And then we have Resplendent, um, again, part of the 2019 store special stalemate pack for breakfast. So moving on over here, this is a new shelf to me. Um, it is, I put a couple more stalemates and stuff on it just to help with room for my stalemates. So starting on the top here, we have my foals. This is all my little lying down foals that I have uh, from left to right. We have Lavender Sky. She was part of the... Um, mystery foal, I think, stalemate surprise for one year. I don't remember all the years. And then we have a um, Twilight Zone, the little Appaloosa. Again, another stalemate surprise foal model. And then we have the little Red Roan. His name is Roan Ranger. And he was part of like a foal, stalemate foal and kittens playset. And then we have a Spotted Charm. Again, another stalemate um, surprise foal model. Now we have some other foals and some ponies. We have Quimby. He's an older, just little standing stock foal. And then we have a little Appaloosa scratching foal. Again, I think part of the stalemate foal surprise sets. And then we have two ponies here. We have uh, this girl. This is Mountain Time. And she is from, again, another 2006-2008 uh, single assortment stalemate package. And then we have this little girl. She's like a little gray Appaloosa. And she is part of the Walmart single assortment um, of recent end of 2019. All right. So moving on to this shelf, we have some draft horses and some sport horses. So on the left here, we have Modern Art. She was, again, a 2006-2008 single assortment stalemate. And we have Sprinkles, um, similar to the... Uh, Grey Appaloosa Pony from before. She was a, I think, like 2018-ish um, single assortment Walmart stalemate. And then over here we have um, Carbon Copy. He was, again, the Briarfest 2019 store special. We have Larkspur, again, a 2006-2008 single assortment model on the Frisian mold. Then we have Kelderon. He was the part of the Briarfest, 20, uh, Briarfest 2019 store special pack. 
We have Abstract Expressions. He was, again, another 2006-2008 single sword and stalemate. We have Pizzazz, otherwise known as Aiden. He was a um, 2018 stalemate collector's club model. And then we have Artifice, and he was another 2006-2008 um, single horse assortment. Over here we have kind of the light breeds and some gated breeds. We have the girl on the left. This is um, Victoria's Secret. She is an older Generation 1 American Saddlebred. She's a little bit shrunk and a little bit leaning compared to, to uh, Rayleigh on the right of her. So Rayleigh is a 2018 Stalemate Club model, and her name is Sephora, so Victoria's Secret and Sephora. And then we have this girl marching on. She is on the Tennessee Walking Horse mold. Generation 3, maybe? I might be wrong, but um, she was, again, another 2006-2008 single assortment model. And then we have Brighton, get an older Generation 1 Morgan Stallion. And these guys are all um, Briar that I've showed you, except for those two stone chips. And then we have Flair Extraordinaire. She was a 2019 Stalemate Club at Collector's Club model. And then we have two little Arabians here. We have um, In the Spotlight and One Night Only. In the Spotlight on the left is a mayor. She was um, some kind of limited run, because I know I put her in the wrong class at Briarfest Live, but I don't remember what year she was from. And then One Night Only is one of the 2006-2008 just single sword men's mates there. Nice guy. So moving down here, we have kind of some draft horses. Well, not draft horses, stock horses, excuse me. Uh, we have this guy. He is another single sword men from uh, 06 to 08. And I call him Strawberry Avalanche. And then we have this girl. This is design, Designed Skyline. Um, she is a surprise, like still made surprise from Walmart from, I think, either 2017 or 2018, around that time. And then we have these two on the standing stock horse. We have Vertigo, the paint, and she is from the single assortment, uh, 06 to 08. And then we have um, Vindicated Embers, and she is from, a, similar as Design Skyline, one of the uh, surprise, Walmart surprise blind bag stalemates from their first, like the first series. And we have these two guys over here. We have um, Andante. He is one of the Briarfest uh, single day stalemates. And then we have Claws, the most recent 2020 first release in the stalemate club. Let me have some unrealistic guys over here. This is Faith, one of my only other stone chip models. Um, she is on the stock horse mo uh, full mold, and she is uh, customized to have wings and a horn. She was from the Design a Horse, Design a Chip program in 2014. And then I have two Alvaroso stalemates from the Surprise Stalemate um, Unicorn bags at Walmart. Neither of them have names. And then I have the pink Icelandic model, again, another Walmart Surprise bag model who doesn't have a name. And then coming down here, getting to the last of the stalemates, we have this guy. He was another 06 to 08 single assortment model on the Peruvian Paso mold. I really like his face. He's pretty cute. And then we have this girl. Um, his name is Tango, by the way. And then we have this girl. This is Dust Bunny. She was a Briarfest 2007 special run with two other stalemates, but I just have her separately. And then we have this guy, this is Blank Space, and he's on the more recent stalemate and illusion mold from Briar, and he was a single storm stalemate from a couple years ago. And then finally, over here, we have this guy, this is Sandcastle, otherwise known as Finn, one of the Briar uh, 2018 stalemate club models, the Gambler's Choice Mule. And I got him. Alright, so moving on, we'll go over to the shelf. These guys, we'll go back to traditionals here. So starting on the left here, we have this girl. This is Breath of Heaven. And she is just a 2000, I think, 16 design a horse Arabian foal, Peter Stone. She's in a nice bay. She's really cute. And then we have this guy. This is Raiden Solo. He was a 2014 design a horse on the Blue Angel mold to a strawberry roan. And then we have this guy. This is... um. 
a flea bitten gray 2016 design a horse with a straightened head from peter stone i bought um him second hand i didn't sign him and then we have this girl this is flavia her of name is flavia and her the name that i gave her is uptown girl she's a 2015 one of a kind arabian yearling from stone and then we have this guy this is acadia briar uh, 2017 web special limited to 350 pieces from the America the Beautiful series. And his OF name is, or his, wow, his show name is Foxtrot, excuse me. And then in front of him we have a Peter Stone Pebbles Arabian. This is, his OF name was Waterford Crystal, and I renamed him Princeton. He was from 2013, I believe. Then we have my Briarfest 2019 special run Rocket, who I've decided to call Rocket Man. A nice guy and then we have this guy this is um lancelot he was a web special from 2018 i think gambler's choice on this mold i got the appaloosa and his uh, show name is cherished moment and then we have my beautiful glossy verdades he was the or verdades i don't know how you say his, his OF name exactly um he was one of the options for the um 2019 collectors club appreciation glossy models i bought him second hand and his show name is take a chance and we have my of briar Titalis, and his name is the dark knight and my of briar lady phase or lady phase wow um gg valentine who i call lady bay excuse me and then we have another stone here. He's a stone thoroughbred, customized with a raised foreleg and slightly turned head. And his name is um, Frosted, but his original finished name was Yes I Can, and he was a 2006 limited edition of 100 pieces. Alright, so continuing on, we're almost to our last shelf after this one. These are my two customs. On the left we have Gloria, and she was a 2014 customized um gg valentine model from monica west or by monica west and she's really nice and then next to her we have a 2010 fairly drastic custom american saddlebred by De um deborah brown of the uk his name is heartless deceptions then we have my stone gated models here we have king of thieves a stone 2014 one of a kind original name caspian and then we have another, my other stone Morgan. This is Spring Awakening, and he's just a, I think, 2013 Designer Horse stone. And then in front of them, we'll go to her. This is Hummingbird Hollow, and she is a, I think, 2008 limited edition of five pieces. Her OF name is Jane Austen. We have my two Peter Stone American Saddlebreds. We have Night Fever on the left, whose original finished name is Christmas Waltz. He was a limited run, but I do not know exactly how many were made. And then next to him, we have Sparks Will Fly, and he is a judge's model from, I think, 2017. Um, limited to seven pieces made. And then we have these guys down here. These are just two mini winnies. Um, they're really cute. I like the molds a lot. Found them at Briarfest. On the left, we have uh, Jitterbug, and then on the right, we have Footloose. Continuing over here, we have Ambulare. He was a 2012 designer horse, um, Tennessee walking horse from Stone. I am thinking about getting him redesigned and just doing, um, he does have some flaws and stuff, so I'm thinking I might sell him and just get a new designer horse uh, in the pale dappled buckskin color. But I do like his color a lot. And then we have Stormfront. He is the Briar uh, Premier Club model. I think 2017 is the year, Duende. Next to him, we have my only stone and illusion. He is a 2016 one of a kind. His original finished name was The Ambassador, but his OF name, or his show name now is Ferrero. And then next to him, we have the Briarfest 2019 um, surprise special run model. This is Quest for Treasure, and he's the matte kind of amber champagne pearl kind of color. And then we have these guys. This is Moxie on the left. She's my only Schleich that I show. Uh, she's just a Schleich donkey, and she does tend to do pretty well for me. And then we have my Briar companion donkey called Sprite. 
All right, moving on to the final shelf. These are all of my OF Stone uh, Ideal Stock Horse models and my two stone wheelings. So going left to right here, we have this guy. Um, he's a Bay Appaloosa, and I do not know. It's unknown what his original finish name and the year that he was made was, but it's thought that he might be a 2012 one of kind, but there's nothing out there for sure. And his name is uh, Reckless Abandon. And then we have my next stone Appaloosa. This guy is a designer horse. I forget his year. It might have been 2017, but I'm not positive. Um, he has a chin spot, the forelock over his eye, his other eye is blue, and he's in the buckskin Appaloosa color. And his name is, um, oh, give me a second to think of his name. I'll come back to it. I will think of it and I will come back to it. <laughs> Um, and then we have my new Appaloosa guy. He is a 2012 one of a kind. His original name was Barrow, and his name with me is Risky Business, and his name is Rebellious Outlook. There we go. Thought of it. So I kind of went with a theme with them. We have Reckless Abandon, Rebellious Outlook, and Risky Business. And then we have this guy. This is, um, I'm thinking of a new show name for him, but previously I've called him Fire and Ice. I think I'm going to change it. But he's just a factory customized red roan stone stock horse. Two blue eyes, um, some KC spots. He's pretty cute. And he is a 2009 one of a kind. His um, OF name, I think, is Rancho Rio. Pretty sure that was what it was. And then we have this girl. She is a 2012 one of a kind. Uh, auction model and her OF name is McBride, but I've decided to call her Twist of Fate And she's really nice She has some of the most lovely eyes of any of my stone models. Her eyes are just lovely and Etched markings. She's a minimal Tobiano Then we have my next stone paint model. This is Oliver Twist. His original finished name was Clive and He was a I think 2011 one of a kind then we have this guy. This is a 2017 limited run of 14 pieces. I think 14 pieces. Um, and he is one of five that are mapped. And his original finished name was Dream Maker Shadow, but I've decided to call him Smoky Mountain Mystery. That's the name he came with, and I do like it. So we're keeping it. He's a newer model. I like him a lot. Next to him we have my 2012 one of a kind Welch. And I've decided to rename him, or give him a show name of Through the Grapevine. He's a nice factory customized liver chestnut. It's pretty cute. Then next to him we have these two. Um, this guy, the sooty buckskin, is Day Trader. He was a 2012 designer horse with the windswept mane and tail and a braid, braided forelock. He was my uh, first ideal stock horse model, so that's pretty, pretty exciting. I really love him a lot. He's a lovely model. And then we have this girl. This is um, Undone Rap is her show name, but she is a portrait model of a horse that I used to take lessons on that passed away in 2014. And she's lovely. Um, really awesome shading. One of the nicest models that I have with, with shading. So she's technically one of a kind. She's a portrait, stone portrait model. And then we have my two weanlings here. We have this girl. This is um, Twist and Shout. And she is a 2015, I think it's 2015, uh, limited run of 15 pieces. And her name was like Tiger 4. She was made after a Shinkatigue pony foal. Designed after, I should say. And I call her Twist and Shout. And then we have this girl. This is Mina. She was one of my older models in my collection. I got her at Briarfest 2012, and she was made in 2012, and she is a limited run of 30 pieces. Her original finish name is Mina, but I have decided to call her Heart and Soul. So Heart and Soul and Twist and Shout, that's kind of a thing I have going with my weanlings. So if I get any more, I'm going to put, you know, a name that kind of matches with that with the N in the middle. So that's them. And overall, this is my collection. I'll do kind of a quick overview for you guys here. So all those guys, all those guys, and we do have my stalemate models as well. 
The only models that I have on this shelf down here are sale models. We have this guy who's just hanging out down here. He's my Briarfest 2019 signing model from like the social media meetup, which is pretty cool. And then I, these guys over here are kind of little sale models. So that is that. That is my whole collection. Thank you so much for watching this collection tour video. I know it's kind of long. Uh, if you have any questions, as always, leave them down below. Any video suggestions, and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great uh, week, great day, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye, guys.